What up, y'all? I'm trying to record and hold the phone. Now, I can't say like Mr. O'Shea, Duke Jackson, and Mr. Kevin Samuels. This, look, my daughter's talking about some yes, like I'm preaching. <laughs> look, um, I'm trying to exercise and get, and keep it right, keep it tight. You feel me? Now, I'm not gonna sit here and act like some of my choices ain't help me stay small. Now, you know people, when they have a, when they have a dark, oh, that's one of my neighbors talking to his kids. When people have an alternative lifestyle, you get what I'm saying? Like you used to partying and all that. You don't take care of yourself. You ain't gonna keep weight on you like people that taking care of themselves, eating every day. Not saying they eating healthy, just saying like putting on weight. If you out partying, drinking, doing drugs and stuff like that, you're not gonna gain weight. So even though I made some bad choices, cause I'm not a hypocrite. Um, I ain't gonna say I thank God for my bad choices, but you know, it is what it is. I'm just glad I didn't get obese from, you know, doing other stuff. Well, whatever. I don't want to sit here and ramble and make myself sound stupid. But let's just say like this. Um, as far as keeping yourself in shape, that's a must. Especially if you got things like this right here. Look, I couldn't push two strollers at once, y'all, so don't judge me. Hey, you all right? Yes. Okay, now that's all that matters. She said yes. I know. I was going to let them stay with their brother, my 15-year-old, because he over there with his friends hanging out, but I'm going to let him have his time because he ain't the daddy. I'm married, and I don't just have kids with my husband. I had two kids but two other people previous. So my husband basically played his stepdaddy and whatever, all that other stuff for two other men's kids. So it's like... How people say, oh, you can you can have kids by all these different people. You can get married. Yeah, you can. But what are the odds? And you got, ladies, we got to listen to what Mr. O'Shea and Kevin Samuels be saying because they are men. That's like when I be listening to my daddy and my uncles, some women be like, oh, that, the men, let, let the men talk. Yeah, let them talk. So that means be quiet and listen. If you listen, you will learn a lot from listening to the opposite sex. But as far as men, men don't need to learn nothing from women. God didn't make us first. I hate to say it, ladies, you want to use the Lord? Who did he make first? All right. Because I know you ain't going to argue with me about that. You don't want to go there with me, uh, ladies. Because I'm not going to say men. I'm not going to argue with no man. Like Kevin and O'Shea don't say. You want men to protect you, but you want to act like a man. No, if you're going to bump, then men going to let you bump. Now, you act like a woman. <laughs> They gonna make sure don't no other man try you. Now, as far as women on women, that's just ignorant in itself. But you know, the type of woman I am, no man is gonna stand and really watch me get into it with no other woman because they'll be like, no, 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 don't let that happen. Like, nah, because they already seen who started how I went when I was younger, boop de boo. But <laughs> that's another subject. Look, I'm getting off subject. Health, it's not easy. It's not easy, ladies. I just had a daughter. My last child, I'm one of my kids. I ain't even like, oh, well, get more money. No, I used to say if I get more money, like millions, I have all these kids, but I really, no, I don't want all them kids. Cause it's, it's responsibility. Like if one of them ain't in my eyesight, you just don't know how stuff happens in the world. To think about four children is a lot in this society. So I, I'm, I'm good. Okay. I'm sitting, waiting on traffic to come by so I can finish pushing my babies. Look, let me show you my son. He over there, hanging out with his little friends. But, um, yeah, just try to keep yourself in shape. Try to, like, especially, look, young girls that don't have children, you better listen to Mr. O'Shea and them so you can get that right person. If it ain't gonna be the highest, the most eligible, what, hold on, what kind of bachelor did you say? Like, let's say the top, the top 10%, or whatever. Cause look, I'm exercising, my mind is in a million places, but a high value man, high value man. If, y if you women are, you know, in high school, getting out of high school, let's say 18 and over, cause I'm gonna be like Mr. Samuels, if you can't vote, I ain't talking to you. 
<laughs> if ladies, the grown women that are 18 and over, listen to these men. They are high value men. Listen to them. If you want that, listen. And if you just want, you know, yourself a, a good man, you got to compromise. You got to listen to these men. You can't be not, you know, I don't want to say like Beyonce, Rihanna, but you can't just be yourself but want a man to be this, this, that, and third. Like, we all got to get in where you fit in sometimes. <laughs> These kids right here, we have me cracking up laughing. But look, I'm finna, I'm about to, I don't want to talk too slang, but I'm about to park for a second. I'm going to ask my son, will he push his sisters around the parking lot for like five minutes while I jog? up the street, back down the street real fast, get my little sprint on. I ain't trying to be rude, but I'm just like, that's usually how they say black women. I don't want to be a statistic. Black women don't always be the statistic. Let other people start being the statistics. Let other people act even. Let other people fight. Let other people get overweight and let other people do their thing because Every time stuff falls down, we always end up being at the the center of it. Like, I ain't going to mention certain stuff. Let's just say a certain illness that popped up around the world. First, it went from one race to uh, black people. How? But anywho, because this ain't even about that. This is <laughs> it's about us just keeping ourselves healthy, keeping that smile on your face, listening to when men tell us stuff to help us. Every man ain't trying to get in your jaws to tell you down. Some of them actually trying to help you. Just listen. <laughs>